Hi Droyo friends! Today we'll show you how to set up floating and fixed endpoints. Let's start with floating connector points. In this case, the connection of a shape docks to the other shape's border and moves along that edge when you move one or both shapes. If your connection point is a floating connection, you'll see an O at the start and end point. Now, how do we build floating connections? Whenever you create a floating connection, you're going to contact the color blue. To start, you'll use the blue arrows to drag a floating connection. These arrows are displayed at the top, bottom, left and right of the shape. When you drag the connection to the target shape, you'll want to move the mouse into the shape until a blue frame appears around it. Release the mouse and you'll see that both endpoints of the connection have an O and the connection flows along with both shapes as you move them around. By the way, the floating start end connection is the most common in Drawio. It's set by default when you use the shape picker for a new shape. Or when you connect a shape from the shape library via drag and drop. Let's move on to fixed connections. Fixed connections dock at a defined point. If you need to move your shapes, the connection will still dock precisely at this same point. Fixed connections are represented by an X at the start and end point. And again, setting up this kind of connection is very simple. When you think of a fixed connection, think green. In this case, we ignore the blue arrows and turn to the various X markers that you'll find along the frame. Hover over one of them and wait until you see a green circle around it. Now draw a connection and release the mouse as soon as you see a green circle around the target shape X marker. Now you have three options. First, you can dock to one of the X markers. You can also move your mouse along the frame until a green highlight appears to create a free set endpoint. Or you can move the connection into the target shape by holding down the Alt key. Of course, you can also combine the two options for the ultimate inflexibility. Just drag a connection from one of the blue arrows to a green X to generate a floating start and a fixed endpoint. Note the O mark at the start and the X mark at the endpoint. But what if you change your mind? It's simple. Here we have a floating start point. We select the connector and drag the start point slightly away from the frame while holding down the mouse button. You can now choose an X for a fixed point on the shape. From fixed to floating, the procedure is the same. Select the connector, move the endpoint away from the frame while holding down the mouse button and then move it into the shape until a blue frame appears and X becomes O. You can use these two connection methods in a variety of ways. This is the holy grail of connections in Drawio. Share it with all your Drawio friends and be sure to leave us a comment if you have any questions or suggestions. You'll also find valuable information in the video description below. Take care and, as always, may the force draw with you.